good employees already have jobs. It's just that the number of people participating in the workforce has lessened. Jobs in the U.S. grew by more than 200,000 last month, and the unemployment rate remained constant. While some may look at this as good news, we spoke with a local expert who says there's another number we should be looking at. WCIA3's Ariana Williams is with us. Ariana, what's that missing piece? I spoke with Express Employment's marketing manager in Champaign, and he says it's the labor force participation rate that paints the picture. Those numbers represent people who are eligible to work and are actively looking for work. But since the start of the pandemic, we've seen a 1.3% decrease in those numbers. One of those reasons is believed to be a mixed match of experience and expectation. Express says now job seekers are more serious about their work-life balance requirements. If every candidate that you interview is saying, I want a four-day work week, I want uh, hybrid work, I want um, whatever it is, right, whatever those concessions are, and your business is able to operate and grow uh, with that labor force, with employees working that schedule, then I think you look into making some of those changes. He says there's a culture shift happening in the world of traditional work that companies and employers are going to have to learn to grow with. But he, is also, but he also advises those who have found or have a job that already meets the majority of their requirements to hold on to it. Renee, back to you. Ariana, thanks so much.